Hi Sagittarius, it's Power and Light Tarot coming at you with the reading. Today we have a short reading, and this is really about the future, uh, basically, right? Kind of like from here, uh, you know, till tonight, till this weekend, till, you know. Uh, that's really what it is, and I can tell you it's already really beautiful. Yeah, it is. And so, you know, I pulled uh, several cards here. That's kind of how I've been doing it with these uh, kind of short reads. And uh, you have adventure coming hope and happiness, blessings, rainbow blessings, Sagittarius, are showering your life. The community card is here, and uh, the rainbow is, you know, uh, kind of coming through these trees, and we see butterflies there as well. The light is showing up, the bird is here, and, you know, it's about kind of his, his, the little bird, his delight, right, and, uh, He's there with the flowers, and it's a beautiful day, and, you know, I'm sure he's chirping away, right? And we have frog spirit clear out the clutter. I'm not sure what that is about. <coughs> and we have hold the course. Staying focused. This could be you, right? Uh, I feel like you have an adventure, and somebody's focused, or you're focused, right? These blessings are going to be coming into your life very soon. I can just feel this reading is already very, very soon. So let's get a few tarot cards. Let's see what we have. We also have the Lion Spirit. Be generous of spirits. It's possible uh, in this reading that, you know, uh, clearing out the clutter maybe could help you be generous with your love. Something like that. Let's see what we have for Sagittarius. And we're still going to have... Uh, the love reading that I always do, there will be no extended in this reading. But let's see. Uh, I feel like this is a, a very cool reading. Let's see what we have for Sagittarius currently. Show me Sagittarius' energy currently. We have the Five of Swords. OMG. And uh, what could be Ace of Swords? What to encourage? Oh, goodness. Somebody's uh, upset here. What to avoid? Three of Wands. Let's see, or what to do, what is maybe discouraging here? Let's see what else we have. What is most likely is a renewal with the Page of Wands. Yeah, I can tell this is some type of, a, this is a renewal. And what to hope for is the hanged man, okay? Maybe your person is Pisces, you need to hope for them. <laughs> uh, but, you know, looking at this reading, maybe you feel... Uh, you know, it's possible here in this reading, maybe you feel defeated, right? Possibly, or maybe uh, there could, I feel like there's what's going on here is, is uh, a victory and a loss. That's what I feel like with this Five of Swords. What could be here is the Ace of Swords, and what is most likely is the Page of Wands. This is a victory and a renewal, or, you know, I feel like it's a renewed interest with somebody. And that's what this adventure is going to be. We have the Nine of Swords. Uh, this is what to encourage. Uh, I don't feel like, you know, nobody should be kind of encouraged. I feel like what this card is saying is that somebody's worried here. We have be generous of spirit. Uh, that somebody's not going to let something go. Clear out the clutter. I feel like in this reading, somebody's holding on to possibly the past or holding on to... Uh, too much uh, things that are kind of weighing somebody down. And, you know, somebody here is worried. I don't feel like this is you. It could be, but uh, this definitely is a reading about two people. Yeah, there's no other way to say this uh, or to see this, I should say. Uh, and so I feel like you are supposed to encourage somebody, like, like be generous with your love. Be generous of spirit, right? You're supposed to kind of, I feel like, and nurture somebody who's upset here. <laughs> I feel like that's it. Yeah, see how evil I am? I laugh, right? Yeah. We have the three of wands, you guys. This is going to be what to avoid. I feel like this is saying kind of don't hold, don't turn your back on somebody here. Because blessings are coming in. An adventure. Yeah. And the Page of Wands is what is most likely here. This is a brand new beginning or a renewal, especially here when we see the Ace of Swords over here. And in your outcome is what to hope for. Mm -hmm. I mean, this could be uh, many things. Let's get a card on what to hope for. We're seeing the Hanged Man. Uh, 
Let's see what we have. Ace of Wands reversed. OMG. Somebody's kind of... I feel like someone's coming back for a brand new beginning here. Uh, it's possible there's a loss somewhere here. I don't feel like it's for you at all. No. There's a victory and a loss with this Five of Swords. Somebody could, somebody could feel sacrificed here. Yeah. Be generous of spirit. This is, wow, this is kind of a trip reading. This could be, honestly, Sagittarius, you could be having a victory with somebody and somebody's coming back and they're worried here about how you're going to like, like if you'll take them back, most likely, right? And over here could be somebody could have been defeated right here. Maybe your person has, you know, and this could be like what to hope for. This Ace of Wands is in the reverse. This is the hope for a new beginning, but, you know, I just feel like you're supposed to hope for like kind of a new beginning. But somebody here I feel like is probably being sacrificed with this Five of Swords. We have, uh, now we have the Chariot card reversed. Yeah, somebody here is dealing with a blockage over here. It's almost like you're, it's almost like in this reading, uh, for some that you like, I feel like you're supposed to hope for this brand new beginning. Yeah, you are the ace of it's in the reverse. Uh, and maybe this is what you have been hoping for though, that somebody would be like really kind of enlightened. Like they would, this person who's coming for an adventure that they would figure out their life kind of, and that they would kind of. Uh, yeah, like have an epiphany or be enlightened about what they want. Maybe you have been hoping for them to kind of, uh, you know, really look at life from all angles. Cause that's what the, that's what this, uh, this hangman is. I feel like you have been hoping to remove blockages here with somebody. Yeah. We're going to end this reading and we're going to kind of continue this in the love reading. Yeah. This is, uh, I feel like you have something really beautiful coming here with somebody here. I feel like somebody here could, uh, you could, this person who is coming to you, I feel like they are probably hoping that, uh, you guys are going to clear the clutter out together, like let the go of the past or something that was kind of, uh, bogging you down or maybe holding you back with this clutter. And I feel like they are hoping that you're going to be generous with your love. I'm pretty sure here that's what's happening here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And this could be, this is a really trip here because, uh, in right here, what to hope for, it could be saying here that you, uh, could be hoping that this person, this is what you have been hoping for, like what to hope for, right? That this person will remove their own blockages in their life and see things here, see things for the way they are. Yeah. And somebody else in this reading, uh, somebody, we have the three of wands here and this five of swords, somebody here could be, could be like, there could be a defeat here possibly. And, uh, but you have an adventure coming. You do Sagittarius. And I feel like in this reading, you are kind of, I feel like somebody like kind of woke up here, but you are kind of being guided to open your heart. Yeah, I'm pretty sure here. We're going to end this reading. Thank you so much, you guys for watching and please remember to like, share and subscribe.